OpenAI just released their AI text detector and I want us to test it. To access it, just go to OpenAI blog and then you'll access it here where it says new AI classifier for indicating AI written text. So if you click here, you'll be taken to this article which says new AI classifier for indicating AI written text. So if you scroll down, you'll see it says we've trained a classifier to distinguish between text written by a human and text written by AI from a variety of providers. We also have some limitations here. It says the classifier is very unreliable on short text below 1000 characters even longer texts are sometimes incorrectly labeled by the classifier and then we have sometimes human written text will be incorrectly but confidently labeled as they are written by our classifier it also says we recommend using the classifier only for english text and then it lists some other limitations there so i want us to try out the classifier it says to get started choose an example below or paste the text you'd like to check be sure you have appropriate rights to the text you're pasting so the first thing i'll do is to create some text with chat gpt i'm going to ask chat gpt to write me a 250 article on how to use tiktok so i'm going to copy all of this copy and then i'm going to paste it here and then we are going to submit so that we see what it says it says that the classifier considers the text to be unlikely AI generated. Okay, what just happened here? I don't know what just happened here because clearly we copied AI generated text without even editing a single word. So let's try this again. I'm going to click on regenerate so that we can see if it gives us something different. Okay, so we have our second response. I'm going to copy all of it. Okay. Then we are going to go back to the classifier. So we'll paste our text here. And then I'm going to click on submit. So the classifier considers the text to be likely AI generated. Okay, so it got it right for the second one. So let's try the first one again. So just click on this. This is the first response copy this then we'll take it back to the classifier paste it here and then we are going to click submit so it still says that the classifier considers the text to be unlikely ai generated and that baffles me they did say that sometimes it's inaccurate but let's take that same text and then we can put it into something like gpt0 so gpt0 is also an ai text detector so it says here humans deserve the truth and it's built for educators you can see here down it says built for educators so we want to try it out with the text that we just copied so we'll paste it here also going to remove this last part that says regenerate response then you're going to click on get results so you have our article here with so many yellow highlights so down here it says sentences highlighted are more likely to be written by ai and then it gives us a perplexity score of 35 and a bustiness score of 37 so you can see that our article is most definitely written by ai but let me see if i'm able to test this with text that i actually wrote so i'm going to go and copy an article that i wrote out here so this is 100 percent human written i wrote this myself so i'm going to copy this and then I'm going to go to the AI text classifier, clear this. Then we are going to paste it here. Then we're going to click on submit. So the classifier considers the text to be very unlikely AI generated. And I agree because I actually wrote this myself. So I'm going to then paste this in GPT-0. See what GPT-0 tells us. Okay, so we paste it here. Then we get the results. So your text is likely to be written entirely by a human. We agree again. So it says down here, sentences highlighted are more likely to be written by AI. So you can see it's zero highlighted sentences in there. It also says that average perplexity score is 181. It says your sentence with the highest perplexity, Sai, has a perplexity of 1710, you know, but you know i mean it is what it is so we've been able to test both of those so i think there's some room for improvement but clearly you can see there's a path here and very soon any text that you write using ai will most likely be detected as ai written text also for those people writing articles or even academic papers you may copy something on the internet because you think a human wrote it but it was actually written by ai so when you go to present it and it's put to this test it will say that it was likely written by ai and that would put you into problems so with this advancement 
advance in technology you want to ensure that you're using chat gpt in an ethical manner ensure you're not getting into trouble because of plagiarism now one thing you can do is ask chat gpt to create for you outlines and then you can fill out the articles or parts for yourself also ensuring that you're putting in your voice in there i hope you enjoyed the video if you did remember to give it a big thumbs up also subscribe to the channel for more videos like this in the meantime have a good one and i'll see you in the next video